Hi! Search engines discover new and updated content by following links. But sometimes, pages don't have any internal links pointing to them, making them hard to find. And following links is also not the fastest way for them to discover new or updated content. It's more efficient for search engines to follow a map. Not just a map, an XML sitemap, which we are seeing here. These sitemaps are specifically meant for search engines. An XML sitemap is a list of your website's most important pages. It also categorizes your website's content into posts, pages, and all of the different types of content you might have on your site. This categorization helps search engines understand the structure of your website. These categories all have their own separate sitemap. If we click the post sitemap, for example, we'll see a list of all the blog posts published on Yoast.com. For every post, it shows the date when it was last modified. This helps with SEO because you want Google to crawl your updated content as soon as possible. In short, XML sitemaps give search engines an overview of your content. They can provide backup in case of bad internal linking. They can assist with crawling and they give important additional information to search engines, like when the content was last updated and how it all ties together. But how do you create an XML sitemap? Well, because of their SEO value, we've added the ability to create your own XML sitemaps in our Yoast SEO plugin. This functionality is available for both the free and premium versions of Yoast SEO. If you have Yoast SEO installed, the plugin creates an XML sitemap for your site automatically. If we go to the Yoast SEO settings and then to features, we see this toggle here which is automatically switched to on. You can access your own XML sitemap by clicking the question mark and then this link that says, see the XML sitemap. Yoast SEO also lets you determine what exactly goes into the sitemap. To do this, go to the search appearance settings and click content types. Here you see separate settings for any type of content you have. If you switch the toggle for show X in the search results to no, this type of content won't be included in your sitemap. What's more, Yoast SEO splits up large XML sitemaps to keep them fast, and you can add your sitemap to Search Console and other webmaster tools. This will help search engines find your sitemap fast and allows you to check for sitemap errors. To sum up, a good XML sitemap is like a roadmap of your website that leads search engines to all your important pages, and this can really help with your SEO. No need to create one yourself, because Yoast SEO automatically creates XML sitemaps for your website.